So the start of this generation wasn't the greatest for NVIDIA, I think it's safe to say. Okay, let's not mince words. Every single graphics card box could have just included an apology letter and not a graphics card, and the whole generation would probably have been less of a failure. But that doesn't mean that things can't turn around, and they might just do with the RTX 4060 Ti, the first leaks for which are starting to appear online, and it looks insane. At least as insane as a mid-range graphics card can get. And if the current leaks are correct, then this graphics card will have about the same performance as an RTX 3070. What's even more interesting is that it's supposed to do it with specs that on paper really aren't that impressive. But the overall advances of the Ada Lovelace architecture should be able to get this card there, even if the specs would beg to differ. Now that all probably leads to one obvious question. Why not just buy an RTX 3070? Well, there's two main reasons. Number one is the price, because the RTX 4060 Ti is supposedly going to do all of that for under $500. And yes, the MSRP at launch of the 3070 was also $500. But not only is it difficult to get one at that price nowadays, but also, as far as we know, $500 is the maximum price for the 4060 Ti. Now that in itself would be pretty impressive, but what's also very impressive is the power and thermal situation. Seeing how this graphics card is supposed to have a TDP of just 160 watts, compared to the 220 of the 3070, that is very conservative when it comes to modern NVIDIA graphics cards. So if the very high TDPs of recent cards have got you spooked, then this might be the graphics card for you. And seeing how it is a 40 series card, you do get access to stuff like DLSS 3, which is exclusive to this generation. Again, it's still very early, and a lot of this could change, but so far the RTX 3060 Ti looks like an absolute beast in the mid-range, and might just create a brand new generation of NVIDIA gamers if done right. But it's NVIDIA, so uh... We just have to wait and see. But what about you? Are you more optimistic or cynical when it comes to the 4060 Ti? Let me know down in the comments below. And while we're still here, maybe check out my Patreon, because even a single dollar a month truly goes a long way, while well, you get awesome perks as well. I'd also like to thank my existing patrons, Gavin Burns, Ryan, Oki B, Justin Rage, Ella Ronyak, Bala Troker, Max Sumner, Shane Allcroft, Lance B, Jesse Halberman, and Shallon Odgen. Thank you guys so, so much, support truly goes a long way. Down you can find our merch, store, our Discord server, and our social media links as well. But anyway, that's about it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then remember to subscribe, like, whatever, and I'll see you all in whatever I make next. Goodbye, everyone. Good. Bye.